Alright, hey guys, what's up? It's your boy Mythical. Today we are going to be exposing the fuck out of these retarded 13 year old stupid children. <laughs> so basically, they've been um harassing me and making these fucked up jokes and all that stuff, and they are really wanting to get away with it now by making me look like the bad guy. So I'm here to expose the fuck out of them and tell them, hey man, cut the cap and fuck off. Anyway, let's get right into it. He made fun of Septi's dead dad. Sorry, Septi, if that's a sensitive topic. That's fine. I never made fun of Septi's dead dad. I didn't even know Septi's dad was dead, alright? I even said this on Twitter as well, alright? So, cut the fucking cap. Where's the proof that I made fun of his dead dad? The only joke I made to Septi was him being emo, because I hate emos, not gonna lie. They're fucking annoying as fuck. Alright, so stop trying to justify the fucked up comments you've been making for days over some shit what isn't even true. He made fun of Josh's sexual assault, yeah. Yeah, I would admit this, I made a couple of jokes, but I thought it was okay because he makes jokes himself. For example, when he calls other people virgins... We will call him out for being a virgin because he's a kid, but then he says, oh, I was raped, and we're like, it doesn't count. I might not have any evidence of that, so you don't have to take my word on that, but at the same time, <laughs> if you know him, then you'll probably know it's true anyway, but I don't fucking know. I mean, yeah, I have made jokes, but he never told me to stop, or, well, I don't know if he told me to stop or not. Another girl sexual assault, and, uh... Alright, this is actually really funny because they actually have a clip of me saying that, oh, I hope you get raped by Uncle Boich. Oh, it's funny to see you cry because I could it's not care about you. I'm not actually crying. You're crying. You're legit I'm crying. crying. I can hear the tears hit the ground. Where do you hear tears? Where? From your mic. In town. I don't know where you're at. I just, I just know it's coming through your mic. Everyone this is why you're on the spectrum. Everyone in this server. And this is why you got raped by Uncle Bowitch. Shut the no, fuck I up. Have, I don't have Uncle Bowitch. I'm not raped. Wait, 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 wait. Why are you so specific about the name? Is it because you got. So, let me give you some context. I was fucking joking around. I was joking around. I said Uncle Bowitch for a reason, because Bowitch is a Minecraft YouTuber who I used to be friends with. And that's why I said it. It was clearly a joke. Plus, I, I was fucked out of my mind, man. I was drinking. You can't put all of it on me. Like, you know what? I would take some responsibility just for the sake of you having a fucking point. Eski's aborted child. And then he gets all pissed once people make fun of his grandma. I never made fun of Eski's aborted child once, all right? The whole situation was taken out of context and twisted just to make me look bad as fuck, all right? Yeah, I made a joke, but it was not about the abortion or his child's death whatsoever. I didn't even know about that at the time when I made the fucking joke. The joke was that Eski lost custody of his child. Well, that's what I was told at least. Because the woman who he got pregnant didn't want Eski to look after the child. So I made a joke about that because Eski is an asshole. And if you know Eski, then you know that's true. He is a fucking asshole. Also, if you're so confident that I made fun of this aborted child, then show the fucking screenshots and then I'll give you fucking context to it all, alright? Holy fuck. I find it very funny how they're trying to justify uh, making jokes about my dead grandmother by making up absolute bullshit and twisting everything and not giving much context to the situation just to make me look bad and give them a reason for them to make fun of my dead grandmother. The whole reason why they even started doing it though is because I exposed Josh for doing it in the first place after I told him to stop many times in a Discord VC. I even made a whole Twitter thread about it. It wasn't to cancel him at, at the time, but I kind of take that back now. Because Josh and his yes men have been like harassing me for days. I can't even join a Discord VC anymore on a fucking server without them coming along and harassing me and saying disgusting things and they think they can justify it 
by saying a bunch of bullshit what isn't even fucking true or being taken out of context. Josh has been taking so much shit out of context that I had to delete every single message I had with him on Discord just to make sure he doesn't take anything out of context anymore because it's really getting annoying and he's putting people against me because of it. He's manipulating people for going against me on shit what isn't even fucking true. I also had to record one of the calls I was in with them just to fucking get proof of them being absolute assholes. Well anyway, I'm going to show you some of the audio clips now. I did cut it a lot by the way, because the shit what I was saying, I'm not sure if YouTube would be too happy. So if they want the raw footage, well then I will release it somewhere else where it's not on YouTube. So they don't claim that I'm manipulating the whole fucking thing by cutting clips and all that. If you really want to try that, then fucking try it then, because I'm not afraid to release the entire fucking 30 minute recording what I have of you guys being utter cunts. I no, that, I'm not no, Mythical <laughs> likes the molder, because like, remember, he fucked his grandma to death. Yo, yo, Mythical. So, yo, Mythical, I've got defibrillators from fucking COD, do you think I can bring your grandma back? Damn, wait. Oh my god! I miss her, bro. She was my ride and die. You know, we, we robbed banks she was together. My villa, bro. It's I'm weird. It's not like I just here. went to the store, grabbed the mic, and then shot a gun, <laughs> and then killed someone's random grandma, and then went home and, you know, used his mic. <laughs> she was just sitting down with her shotgun at the store, bro. I got scared. Anyways, Mythical's grandma, she gave you Mythical's head. grandma, gave me head! Fuck you, Virginia, you know that she's dead! That's what we- <laughs> Wait, Mythical, let me go. No, Josh, go. Go on, go on, go on, go on, do it. My hands, my fingers. Come on, like come on, you can do it. Mythical's grandma. Actually, let me find a different one. <laughs> Dude, come on. Okay. Yeah, Mythical's grandma, she's floating in heaven. Yeah, she's going in the stars. She's in the space where the starships lay. Starships were meant to fly. Hands up and touch the sky. Can't do this one more time. Mythical's grandma overdosed on wine. No, 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 he raised three times the size of his grandma's dead corpse. Bro, I'm, dead. I'm gonna get my mom credit card and just fucking buy someone on Fiverr. I'm doing that shit right now. I don't care. To do what? To Something, do what? Send me like some interesting Fiverr shit. I will buy anything. Are <laughs> you anything? Do, do you want to get a buy someone like a track mythical down and we could kill a mythical? <laughs> That'd be funny. <laughs> no, wait, wait, mythical. Should we'll I make we'll we'll no, Josh, about Josh, that, Josh, 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 Should I make a YouTube channel called XX Mythical Grandma Plays? <laughs> <laughs> wait, you know those memes how they like make like people's like P and G's like mouth open wide open floor? Do that with his grandma. Like find a random grandma P and G like. I am Mythical's grandma. <laughs> I am in heaven. Should I put X Mythical Grandma or RBLX? X X X That's... Grandma plays. Yeah. No, I'm I'm making it X Mythical's Grandma Roblox. <laughs> <laughs> I'm making the X Mythical Grandma plays RBLX account right now. <laughs> Make her a 4chan account. <laughs> oh no, bro. Oh no. X mythical grandma, please. Rest of it, mythical grandma. Rest of <laughs> Oh no, should I make her a Discord account and just go and chase with a spin server? Should I get chased with a spin to make a video on her? <laughs> Wait, let me let me ping it. I I say the stuff I said before. I didn't mean I got hacked. I got hacked I, by Mythical's grandma. I'm a huge fan. <laughs> Mythical <laughs> grandma hacked me. And I already made a video on Mythical's grandma. He like prayed for her to like stay healthy or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs>
Episode six of of the of the Chase Witherspoon show. I think it's like episode six. I think I thought it was like the newest one. I I just said oh, the stuff one. I said before. I didn't mean I got hacked. I am a huge fan. Mythical's grandma hacked me and she's a pedophile. <laughs> she said she was gonna hit me. <laughs> Ex mythical grandma, please. I just made the account. <laughs> Hilly, Hilly. <laughs> Searching for the ghost grandma. <laughs> <laughs> There we go, that's all of the clips I have of them talking about my dead grandmother in the most disgusting way possible. It's really sad actually because I did class Josh as a friend and now him doing this really shows his true colours and man, I'm not gonna lie, it did hurt. It really did hurt to see him go this way and act like an utter cunt for no reason whatsoever. This isn't the first time that he wronged someone as well who was his friend. He had a friend of seven fucking years, by the way. Seven years who he wronged uh, a lot. And they stopped being friends. And then recently, Josh was like, all right, I'm going to apologize so I could be friends with him again. But the thing is, though, his apology was fake. And that's the reason why the other guy from seven years did not even want to fucking speak to him anymore. Because of him lying constantly. And now he's lying again just to be friends. Like... You're causing more of a fucking problem, retard. Well, anyway, I think I'm going to end it off here now. Uh, Josh, do me a favour. Don't fucking talk to me ever again. Don't even talk about me again. I want nothing to do with you. You're an asshole, and this is what you deserve. This to be all out in the public. So, if you don't talk about me, then I won't talk about you, and we can have that agreement, alright? Just... Don't fuck with me anymore. I'm sick and tired of the harassment of you and your yes men. And I know that one of his yes men is going to dislike bombing for you bought this video because he's a fucking loser. I mean, he admitted that he did it before and he has a shit ton of alts as well, what I exposed on Twitter. And uh, yeah, I mean, if he wants to do that, then you're making yourself look like a fucking joke already. I mean, it, it is what it is, I guess. Anyway, I hope I see you guys later, and, uh, peace out. Fucking hell.